Hi guys, it's Otto from Motorize It, and we're going to open up a Somfy motor today. Um, that can be very useful, but you only need to do it if you no longer have a warranty on the motor, because otherwise um, um, the warranty will no longer be valid if uh, Somfy can see that you've opened the motor yourself. The warranty is five years, so only do this for motors older than five years, and if you actually know what you're going to do, because there's not a lot you can change except for the condensator, um, which I'll show you later on. Let's have a look. Um, there's a little pin here with an opening and we're going to push that to the side like so. This will basically open up this ring and give you access to the Torx screw. Remove the ring, slide it to the side, have a little bit more space. So there's a Torx screw here. I'm going to loosen that. so that the motor head is no longer locked in position. And to remove that you need a, a hammer, tap the head slightly until you feel it's coming out of the shell. That's it, this is an RTS motor, an Oxymo um, with different parts. And this is a condensator, so if that's a defective part, then you can uh, replace that, but that's for another video. Now if you're done, you need to put it all back, slide it back in. Make sure everything is in the right position, so align this with this hole in the tube. You can also see that these parts are nicely fit into the slots. Push a little bit in, use the hammer if necessary. Place back the screw. We'll tighten it again to make sure the head is again locked into its position. And you're going to place this part back and you have to align that with the, uh, the little crown that's there. Push it together so you can slide this small part over. There you are, the motor is back in its original state. Now if you want to replace a condensator, I'll show you that in another video. If you have any questions about something motors in general, let me know. Uh, the, the email address is info at motorize.it. Thank you and see you next time.